Virgo. Hey Virgo, welcome back to my channel. And this is the week ahead reading for the sign of Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, or wherever you have a heavy Virgo placement. If you're new to my channel, hello. I pray before each and every one of my readings so that way my energy is protected, your energy is protected as well. If you're returning, thank you so much for returning and trusting me with your energy. I greatly appreciate it. The first message we have here is, wow, we have, you need to know the truth. Hmm. So I'm definitely feeling that divine feminine, there was something that happened, okay? There's an isolated situation. This may have even initiated this no contact period here between you and your divine masculine, but I definitely feel that where you stand right now in your connection, the energy may feel a little bit weird. Um, I'm picking up that for, you know, this, this Divine Masculine here, they have a lot of respect for you, Divine Feminine. I'm also picking up that you have a very transparent relationship. There's something about how you're able to connect with your person and how you all communicate that is different from any other connection that you've had or that they have had, okay? And it's getting to the point where whatever this is that your person is holding back, it feels very, very minuscule, okay, as it pertains to what you mean to them. I definitely feel like this is something that you may have approached your person with, but the answer that they gave you just didn't do it for you, okay? I definitely feel like you need more information. You may have asked them about this, and because they were not willing to openly express what it was that they were feeling or they were not able to provide you a level of clarity that was comfortable for you in that moment, this very well may have initiated this no contact period here. But I'm definitely getting that something about your connection is really, really authentic. I feel like the way that you're able to communicate with your person, it just has a level of authenticity to it that you really respect and your person respects, okay? So the fact that Whatever this issue is that they can't express to you, it's really beginning to weigh on your person, okay? This may even have caused you to look at them a little different um, just because this has shifted the dynamic a little bit here, okay? So let's go ahead and get into the next message. Yeah, we have my feelings for you scare me, okay? Um, I think this goes back into talking about that, that level of authenticity. Um, I feel like you have a very, very sacred bond with this masculine to the point where it's a little bit scary. I feel like this masculine may tell on themselves a lot um, as it pertains to you. I also feel like you just have this element to your connection that is you know, not like any other connection you've ever had before. The fact that they're able, the fact that they're even feeling this emotion that they want to tell you something, um, maybe scaring them a little bit because they're like, maybe this is something they would have hid from someone else here, okay? But when it comes to you, it almost feels weird for them not to be honest. So I'm definitely picking up on a very powerful connection. Maybe you have a very solid friendship with this person because there's something very foundational and very solid about this connection that I'm picking up on here. But yeah, it's actually scaring your person that they want to be this transparent with you, okay? Let's get the next message here. We have, I've tried to replace you. I failed. Okay. So there it is, Divine Feminine. I feel like this is something that may has been may have been weighing on you for a very, very long time. I feel like for a lot of you, this is something that you brought to your Divine Masculine's attention. Now keep in mind that this could be anything, okay? They could have tried to replace you with an actual person. This could be a thing. This could be some type of energy that stood to be a barrier in your connection in some kind of way here. But they're letting you know that they failed. 
they failed big time, okay? And I'm thinking that your person is getting to this place where they're understanding that your energy is irreplaceable, okay? And I feel like it's something, it has something to do with this level of authenticity that you have established in your connection. This could have been something that happened right from the beginning of it. So I definitely feel like whatever this was, I'm, I'm feeling like this could be an isolated situation. This is definitely something that you brought to your person's attention. They were not forthcoming with all the information here. But for some reason, they're boiling over, wanting to express to you, wanting to let you know like every single detail about whatever this is. So I definitely feel like there is a uncanny level of transparency within this connection that I'm picking up on where this masculine even feels that they want to open this up to you, okay? So, um, and I also feel like Divine Feminine, you are someone who values you really, really value authenticity. You value truth. You value transparency. This is something that your person knows. I feel like this may be a deciding factor. Um, you may have come to your person asking them to provide you with clarity for this so you can have a clean slate. I don't know what the terms were, but where your person stands today, they are kind of boiling over um, with this emotion. They've definitely been stuffing this down and it's actually doing them more damage to hold this back from you than it is to just let it out. I think this will be like a breath of fresh air for you. This will probably confirm something that you felt divine feminine, something that you brought to their attention here. Um, but they want you to know whatever this energy was that they tried to replace your connection with, um, they failed, okay? This did not work out for them. Um, if you have access to them visually, maybe on social media, maybe you have mutual friends or something like that, they could have been putting on a front they could have been making it seem as if things were going swell, they were happy, they want you to know they were pretending, okay? This could very well have been something that they tried to self-soothe with um, in order to appease their ego in some kind of way here. Um, I'm definitely getting that if this was a person, if this was in the form of a relationship, this could have been something very, very superficial, something very surface, something that didn't even penetrate their heart space, okay? But they're letting you know that they failed big time. I feel like Divine Feminine, if you're resonating with this message, this is something that you picked up on. This is something that you may have definitely brought to their attention. And whatever answer that they gave you, it just did not do it for you. You knew that there was more information. And where your person stands right now, they're at this place where they're ready. They feel like you need to know the truth. Okay? Wow. Wow. Yeah, this, this may not resonate with, with everyone, but I definitely feel that um, there's a divine feminine out there who really, really felt that there was something um, happening. Even if you're at a distance from your person, this could have very well initiated a no contact period or a break in the communication. Maybe the communication is lagging. Your person may be giving you one word answers. They're not, the dynamic has shifted because they didn't have the ability to be forthcoming and honest with you, okay? And now it just feels a little bit weird. And that's kind of not your norm, okay? I'm definitely feeling a lot of respect, a lot of authenticity within this connection here. Even if, you know, things were not working out, I definitely feel like you both have something about the communication being really, really clear and concise, your person being able to let you know how they feel. And the fact that, they weren't able to do this around this isolated situation really really you know made you pause and kind of look at them a little bit differently but they want you to know that yeah they tried to replace your energy some kind of way okay and it didn't work for them now keep in mind this could be in many ways this this can be in the form of a person um, maybe some type of activity, some type of vice that they have here. You know, this is a general message, so I'm not really sure what this is, but I feel like this is something that has been on your mind and your heart for a while, okay? And it's almost as if your person is coming forth wanting to confirm this for you. So let's get the next message here.
The next message we have is, you're the only one who saw the real me. Yeah, like I was saying, this, this is a really, really, I'm picking up on a really solid connection here, okay? And I'm getting from the very, very beginning. I'm getting, when you came in contact with your person, you were able to see certain parts of them that they weren't even showing you, okay? But you were able to look right into their heart space and kind of, you know, treat them accordingly to what it was that you saw, Divine Feminine, okay? And they want you to know that whatever this, this was that they tried to replace the connection with, um, it was superficial. You're the only person who saw the real them, therefore, it's almost as if you're the only person who gets that version of them, okay? And everything else is kind of closed off to your person in some kind of way, okay? Um, I, hope, I hope this is coming across clear, um, but definitely if you're resonating with this message right now, I feel like there's a divine masculine out there who feels as if whatever this, this, untruth was that they were holding on to is not worth the weight of your connection i feel like you've shown them a level of authenticity you have made them feel as if they're able to be um themselves in this connection here and they may have jumped back into you know a timeline where they had to lie where they had to cover things up here realizing that they really don't need to do this with you okay you're someone who really honors authenticity transparency even if it's something that may be unfavorable to you you're the type of person divine feminine where you want to know the truth you want to have the choice to make a decision how you move forward and by not being honest with you okay your person didn't give you that choice okay so this is kind of why you may have been looking at them a little differently here because you ultimately feel like you're better than that and your person feels like that too it's kind of like they feel a little bit embarrassed um that they've kind of been playing this game you know of, of not being upright and honest with you It's almost as if they're, they're a little bit ashamed of how you might look at them as well. I feel like this is something that could have been dragged out way longer than it needed to be dragged out here. Um, and this is because they feel a little bit of shame around what they've done and the fact that they weren't able to be honest with you. They also could be thinking about how you view them at this point. You know what I mean? Because I feel like Divine Feminine, you're someone who's just like, why couldn't you just tell me that? You know what I mean? I could have, you know, gotten over it. We could have talked through it. We could have went our separate ways. Whatever would have happened, would have happened. But, you know, you didn't have to omit the truth. Okay? So, yeah. Definitely get um, very regretful energy coming through here. It's almost as if something got turned into a way bigger deal than what it had to be. Okay? Let's get the next message here. Yeah, the next message we have is, I'm healing from my past. Yeah. Um, I definitely feel like whatever this energy is, this was definitely something um, external to your connection, some type of past trigger um, that your person did not heal from that definitely spilled over to your into your connection and indirectly affected you, Divine Feminine. I feel like this, is, this doesn't have anything to do with you. This is not a reflection of how your person feels about you, but because this energy had the ability to affect you indirectly, now it's almost as if, you know, your person is feeling ashamed that they allowed it to get this far. They're letting you know that they're healing the version of them that felt like this was okay, okay? Um, there's definitely some past energy lingering within your person here, something that they need to heal from, something that could definitely be a detriment to your connection if they don't heal from this. And I feel like they have come into the realization and that's why they're assuming this position of wanting to be truthful. Okay, this may be long overdue for some of you divine feminines, but I definitely feel like your person is at this energy where they're realizing that it's not really worth it, okay? I feel like they don't want to hurt you. They don't want to cause 
any more delays within this connection and they're realizing that their actions because they they didn't have the tools to really heal from this past energy their past is beginning to affect their future okay so now it's, it's almost as if they have to double back tie up some loose ends to make sure that this doesn't happen again i definitely feel like this is a pivotal point for your connection at this time because your person is spilling over, okay? But they're spilling over with the truth here. Um, they hid this from you, not really knowing how you would react to this situation, but now they're feeling like it's blown out of proportion because maybe it wasn't such a big deal here, okay? Um, or they're realizing that they didn't give you the choice to make a decision on how you would like to move with the situation, okay? So yeah, your person is definitely at this place where they're realizing that they need to kind of heal some things, okay? Because their, their inability to be truthful in this connection is definitely affecting you, Divine Feminine, and affecting the trajectory of your connection. And they feel like it's not worth it. So your person is definitely at this place where they want to open this up to you okay um i feel like this is something that may be long overdue this is something that you definitely brought to their attention they were not forthcoming and now they're at this place where they're realizing you know you may even be slipping away a little bit this may have very well been a deciding factor for you divine feminine where you felt as if you know you and your person were better than this they should have been able to open this up to you. They should have been able to at least be honest with you and give you the opportunity to make your own decision. And because they were not able to do that, you had to make some decisions for yourself, okay? So I definitely feel like this masculine wants to come through and clear the energy, clear the air here. Um, how you respond to this, you know, I don't know. I feel like they don't know either. They're kind of up in the air. They don't know. Um, if you will be receptive to this, but they definitely feel like they at least owe you the truth. Okay? Because they know ultimately that that's very important to you. And I feel like you definitely had this connection where you were able to be truthful with one another. So whatever this was, you know, kind of really changed the dynamic a little bit, made things a little weird. Let's get the last message here. Wow, yeah. We have, I can't do this anymore, yeah. Your person is realizing that they've been extremely inauthentic with you here, and they, they really didn't have to. Um, it's really hurting them more to assume this position of, of operating in their ego, not really acting as if this this connection is as important to you as it is as important to them as it is okay but they're letting you know they can't do this anymore they can't do this anymore okay they're they're not willing to allow this isolated situation to change the trajectory of your connection here so i definitely feel as if there will be some truth coming through so that you can speak to your person so that you can heal this how this affects your connection going forward, if you will be receptive to this, okay? You'll only know when you have this conversation. But yes, these are the messages that I have for you all tonight. If you resonate with this message, be sure to hit the like button on the way out, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye. Bye.